Trick or treat! Welcome back, friends. If you're new here, I'm Marie from Disney Crazy Family, and thank you so much for stopping by today. We are part of a wonderful Funko collab. I believe this is the second year in a row. Our friend Jamie from Jamie's Colorful Kingdom has hosted a Halloween Funko collab, and uh, we're excited to be coming back. This year, I decided to go ahead and show 13 of my favorite Disney villains. Let's just get started. Please make sure to go check out Jamie as well as everybody else linked down below. I'm super excited to see how they display their Halloween props and uh, what they have in their collections. So I decided to go with uh, a chronological order. And first up, we have this lovely black light Captain Hook. Super excited. Ginger from Just Ginger's Love of Disney got this for us in the pirate swap, which I will link that up above over here on the right and down below if you don't know what I'm talking about. Super great collab hosted by some lovely friends of ours, Raising a Disney Princess. I am so happy that I was able to uh, be gifted this Funko Pop. Look at the detail and the colors in Captain Hook. He is just stunning. Up next, we have Maleficent. This is a glow-in-the-dark chase. First time I've ever seen a chase Funko in the wild. I was super excited to grab this. I really like this style. We have Cruella in her really cool car. I like that her eyes are like Mr. Toad. Big note, I am a in the box collector for the most part, so all of these are going to be in the box. I do apologize, but uh, it's just easier for me to display that way. And on the back here is what the car actually looks like. It's a really nice graphic from one of our favorite Disney movies of all time, Madame Mim, in her pig snout form. I actually do have the regular um, dragon. I don't have the chase dragon, but eventually maybe I'd like to get that one, complete the set. Really cute design. Our favorite rat, but don't call him that because he will get upset. Love Radigan. This is really cool. Hey, Funko, can we make a Toby, but like a giant Toby? Because he's a dog. Oh, I love this. I love this so much. I am looking for Basil, so if anybody has an extra one that they would like to trade, please let me know. This is really cool. I like the detail. Look, they got all the medals and regalia on his shirt. Very cool, very sinister. I really like this one a lot. I am a big Disney Afternoons fan, so I had to include my girl Magica Dispel. Really, really nice design on this one. I like that they included the crow that she often has with her in her dastardly deeds. We have the very dangerous Doctor Doom from Who Framed Roger Rabbit big big fan of this movie i really like how inclusive of all the characters this movie is i think it's fun to have a villain who's also a toon and wants to get rid of the tunes and look how cute this little uh this little shoe is i love this from darkwing duck we have nega duck this is a special uh, PX Previews display piece. I really like this one. Um, I believe there is a black and white version that my buddy Jake from Jake's Disney Afternoon might have. Uh, please go check him out. He is the go-to guy if you need to know something about Disney Afternoons. I love Jake. I always learn something new. Now, my biggest collection is NBC. This is my biggest section in the collection. I really like the black light so, so much, and it works so well on the NBC Pops. I do have the mayor that was gifted to me last year by uh, 
our castle life and I really appreciate it. It looks great. I do need to get a black light soon though so I can display things. Up next is probably one of the oldest pops I have in my collection. It is from 2000 and... 12, 2013. I got this on a trip uh, back in high school. I really like this. Oh, and this actually came from the Disney store. That's where I got it. Like, that's how old you know this is. These are really cool. If I had been smart, I probably would have got the Cheshire Cat and the Alien because I really like the look of those too, but now they're like super pricey. But anyway, this is a really, really nice addition. Uh, one of the few pops I have in a hard case, so that's pretty awesome. Up next... Cuteness! So much cuteness. I really like Yzma, especially when she's in cat form, and I think this is one of the cutest designs they've come out with in a really long time for Emperor's New Groove. Um, her holding the little acorn is just perfect. Perfect on that cuteness cake. I love this. And another gift from last Pop Miss. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'll link that video up above too. From Andrea over at Our Castle Life. Oh, look at him. Look at him. Bill Cipher looks so good. I think he's come out of his... Uh, little holding cell, but I am so stinking happy about this. I am so close to being a uh, Gravity Falls completist. I love this show so much. <sighs> this show defined a generation, guys. It defined a generation. I am super happy about it. <sighs> I, I hope they continue with the Gravity Falls line. Supposedly there are concepts floating around there that Funko is going to do some more from the show. I would love Wendy. I would love Seuss. I think it'd be awesome. And then last but not least, um, a show that may not have gotten enough love. Ludo Avarius and he's like a little, um, what do you want to call him? He's He's not really a bad guy towards the end of the show, but he's definitely um, a character who develops a lot throughout the series. I like him. Um, the show was great. It was funny. Not as funny as Gravity Falls, not as um, an emotional attachment for me as Gravity Falls, but I do like the show a lot. Both shows are on Disney Plus. If you have that and you want to go check them out, I highly recommend. I really like the um, skull cap that he's wearing. The show is heavily based in magic and like weirdness. So if you're into that, I highly encourage. So thank you, Jamie, so much for having us uh, collaborate with you again. We really enjoy doing these Funko collabs with you. And I am super excited to see what everybody shows down below. So please make sure to go check them out. If you're new here, please consider liking, subscribing, and definitely comment down below what your favorite pop of the video was. Are we twins on anything? Have you seen any of these weird shows that I'm talking about? And uh, please let me know what your favorite Funko Pop is within your collection. All right. Thank you, friends. Hope you have a spooktastic day today. See ya.